Welcome to Wise Beyond Bitcoin, where you come for education, analysis, and opportunities in blockchain and crypto. My name is Lucas. And my name is Ryan. And we have more secret news, more crypto secrets to share. And of course, um, secret network I'm talking about. This is not financial advice. This is not marital advice, legal advice. This is not medical advice. It's not, we're not trying to add to any of your vices. Keep your own. We're just sharing our research. Do your own research to be your own bank. Um, That being said, this is a great time to get involved in crypto. We're at the beginning of a lot of innovative projects that are launching. And when it comes to NFTs, we really, really love talking about how Secret Network brings a whole new dynamic to the NFT world. And we do have a little NFT alpha to share with you. So if you like this kind of stuff and stand abreast of the latest and greatest crypto secrets and other opportunities in crypto, give us that love, that subscribe, that uh, notification bell thing, the like button, thumbs up, drop a comment, let us know what we got wrong, what we got right about something else going on in crypto, because we can only take in so much. It's the, the space is growing so fast. We we take right. in what we can, we digest it, and we put it back out there. There are many things that we, we can't. So we all are in this together, and we do appreciate that love and feedback. Well, without further ado, uh, let's check out this website, secretnft.com. Yeah, this is a sweet site. You can see uh, there's a home okay. button. If you click on, then there's a secret NFT tab, and you get to see um, what what projects, what NFT projects are coming up on Secret that you should be aware of. Now, this is cool because I, I was, and I want to start sharing more about the use of validators. I was talking to someone on Discord earlier in the Secret community. Uh, I think it was a, I was talking to a validator. And many validators, when you look at Secret or Atom or um, Luna, these mm-hmm. validators, these people who you're delegating your, your coinage to and they're securing the network, many of these, they're not passive people that are just taking your money. A lot of these people are looking to add, they're, they're validators they're because they believe in the community, the project, and they're, they're, they want to add value to what they have. So you often find that, do your research on the validators too, because there are some really, really awesome validator communities, people out there that are building, adding value to the space and and doing stuff to give back. And I will definitely do more to share specifically. We'll do a staking video, how to stake secret and do the Kepler wallet. And we'll go through some of the uh, many premier premium validators out there. And I might miss some. So if you're a validator and you say, hey, drop my name in there too, let us know what's up. But I, I, I say that because when we first came to this website, we were kind of doing our research. What is this? This is one of those secret NFT. This is a validator. Right. And, and now they've created a, a pretty cool website. Very cool website to give back and add value. So you can actually, if you like the secret NFTs and the secret NFT communities, secret pages, we were talking about that, then you can, you can go in your wallet. When you stake your secret, you can pick secret NFT as a staker. And this, these are, these are the people right here that you are supporting and you can see this website and the things that they're building to bring back and add value to the space. What do I need to install to have a Chihuahua chain wallet? You know, um, so mm-hmm. this is well, their. That, that speaks yeah. to me. I'm going to have to check that out too. I know. I, I figured you guys would. In fact, what you, I need to walk you through after this video because you have some, you just haven't picked it up yet. Okay. Good, yeah. good to know. Love um, airdrops. You love air. We, we do. We love airdrops and we love supporting those communities that give back. Secret NFT project. So if you come to secretnft.com, one of the cool things that they're working on is letting people know about, it's just a great resource of what NFT projects are being built on secret and are launching. And so that's why I think we'll, we'll leave all these links below so you can check it out on your own time. But it's just a great resource if you want to look at without having to go to Stash App Marketplace and, you know, scroll through all the different NFTs that pop up at different times based upon latest releases and pricing. You can come, this is a little bit more organized where you can read about the creator, about the purpose, what they're doing, what owning a cat comes with various perks they believe will help build a close knit and active community. You've got websites, Twitter, Telegram. So all the links that you need to become involved, very, very comprehensive. Helpful. Yeah, very helpful, thoughtful, Mm -hmm. put together very well. Love a lot of these projects. We were talking about this before the video. This looks beautiful. We'll do a whole video on that. Mm-hmm. Um, but 
today's video, Secret Dogs, we've talked about. There's just some really, really cool projects. Hello, Mystic Skulls. Yes, hello, Secret Rocks. That's what I want to get to today, only because I grew up playing paper, rock, scissors. This is play to earn. If you've heard about P2E, play to earn gaming and blockchain and crypto, I believe it's the first. Um, I believe it's the first play to earn game on the secret network there. If there's another one out there, please let me know. It's definitely one of the first and they have some really look at these fun that their tokenomic, the design, what they're building seems very fun, very cool. And they're doing it in a way to respect the NFT space on secret network with their attractors. They're, they're offering people these like golden tickets, like Charlie and Chocolate Factory, where you hold this attractor NFT. And by holding that NFT, you can stake it, you can burn it, you can use it to receive your airdrop for rocks for, for other airdrops in the future. So they don't have to code all those complexities into the NFT. It just needs to have that unique ID with which they can bring functions and utility add drops later, which is neat because right now- Yeah, that's a cool innovation. Scalability, and you look at when projects are launching and when validators, certain nodes getting choked up and transaction costs. So when you find people that are building and creating in the space and doing it with respect to other people on the chain, that's a good thing. That's cool. Yeah, I feel yeah. like Secret Secret Network has some of the more innovative NFT um, um, contracts that are out there, right? When you say with the, not to mention the attractors, but we were talking about earlier about the ability for the original creator to mm -hmm. sort of make a deal with the, with the person who bought it. And then you know, if they wanted to redistribute some royalties or, or, you make know, changes. give change, make changes to the, to the way the contracts, you know, designed, they can both agree to do that. That's, you know, which kind of keeps them in communication with each other and creates a community. So but yeah, you don't the, have the doing some cool stuff. Yeah, you don't have that. I mean, now if you're the owner of a piece of art, an NFT, you could have that original artist reach out to you and say, hey, I want to use that art you have for this charity project. You now are holding on to something that brings the artist and the holder together potentially um, mm -hmm. in ways that other NFTs have not in the past by, by, their, by their nature. This, create, this allows it to just be built in. Not like, right. hey, I hear you have one of my NFTs. I like to work on something, but this is where they can actually come together and change something in the code. To yeah, there's like a pathway in the code for that to happen. Right. Um, definitely scroll through these. But Troub music, I, I think I disclosure, I, I acquired his weekend beat because I was like, wait, music, NFT on Secret Network. I, I chatted with this cat. Very cool. I did love the artwork. I did not get to pick this one. This one. Coup de Grace looks beautiful, but I don't know what it sounds like. The reality is, is I would like to take his beat and put it maybe into like an intro of our vid, just to add a little mm. secret NFT mm -hmm. motif, well, uh, yeah. uh, an Easter egg or something. Yeah, that's an Easter egg for sure. Okay. So, okay. Well, so this is great. And they also have, are we early to secret NFT.com? I'd say so because in three days, in seven hours and 33 minutes. By the time you get this video, it might be like one or two days left because it takes us a while to come up with thumbnails, people. We don't come up with True story. Thumbnails. We would have this video out like immediately, but you have to wait an, a, a day or so for us to get a thumbnail together. Um, but yeah, it's still going to be early. We'll get it out before this list oh, sure. launches and you'll be able to come check out the top projects as they as they are listed. Secret Rocks. Paper, rock, scissors. I mean, I grew up playing paper, rock, scissors. It was so much fun. It brings so much fun to children. And to have an NFT game, I mean, it's just, it's nostalgic, man. It's throwback. Very much. I kind of dig it. And play to earn with privacy, maintaining total privacy on top of the other plans that they have to do with their NFTs. I This looks like the beginning of a pretty neat NFT community. Yeah, it does. Uh, there's going to be rocks, papers, scissors. There's going to be, what, 3,300 variations within each of those classes. Um, and I believe you just need to have three rocks or three uh, three of any of the types, right? To play. And you can play. Uh, you'll be able to stake or not stake. You, yeah, you can stake uh, later on. But right now you can be able to wager your rock in a, in a game or you can not. I think they have two different ways of doing it, right? You can play a little video. Yeah, play the video. <laughs> With the tunes.
sounds like Inya. They got that DeFi Kingdom vibe going on. Mm -hmm. A little bit. Oh yeah, so they're gonna be able to earn rock. I remember they we haven't that's, right. that, that's not out yet, but they're gonna have a token, right? Called rock. They're gonna have a token called rock token coming soon. Cool. Yeah, that's right. That, that, you're right. So you can stake it, and when you win battles, I don't believe you can wager rock token, but I don't believe you earn you lose your NFTs. So people are NFTs. asking questions. You're you're gonna keep your NFT. It's just battling for this rock token, this pool of rock mm -hmm. token. So there yeah. are there are some uh, neat incentives being uh, built in the tokenomics and the gameplay there. As we find out more, we'll share. But you're right, over 3,367. Now, we can still mint these, right? Isn't that the window for minting these rocks is open, right? We're still not too late. That's what's cool. So um, a lot of projects, they have that, a small supply and you have to limit quick or you can't. And they got high bears to entry. Like you need to have like $1,000 or several hundred dollars to, to play. And if you don't, then you're out and too late. That's not secret rocks. That's why we're doing this. If you're looking for a fun way to get involved, to get your friends, to get your family involved in NFT, something that's a low barrier to entry and interactive play to earn. So you can earn crypto just by, by, by playing paper, rock, scissors. You have until um, the mint is live and you have until January 20th to stock up on as many now, uh, look, these things, there's certain little clips. They're going to have different rarities. Uh, mm -hmm. different attributes and things. Attributes to different rocks and paper and scissors, um, depending on the class type. It looks like there's going to be some really neat stuff built into it. The team's pretty active there. I've been following them for a little bit. I have picked up. I think these will make great. I've picked up 15 of these. I think these are going to make great gifts as well. I think um, to get people involved, NFTs, play to earn games are just fun people have heard a lot about yeah. nfts a lot of people don't know anything about bitcoin or crypto have heard about nfts right it's become a buzzword that's popular so being able to give someone their very own nft that has play to earn gaming is just a neat way i feel to get involved and nine secret at around four or five bucks you know 36 like 40 to 45 40 bucks that's not a high barrier to entry in the world of nfts and crypto and if he takes three of them you're talking about like 120 150 bucks and, and you can play you can you can now you can play the game and you've got three different nfts so um it's that that's that's what's neat if you're looking for a low barrier entry something that's fun not financial advice uh, absolutely if if you're thinking this is how i'm going to make it in life don't this is not that's not what this video is about this is not the um I, the alpha, I, this is not the alpha video <laughs> this is not no, i'm not saying go ham and just put every just mint out the last 7974 rock that, that would be some hardcore that'd be a hardcore move i'd like to know who did that if they do if they come through like with that'd be that'd be pretty neat but right now that's not my recommendation just just mm -hmm. have fun with it and this is something that looks now like you, you know, we do want to make it clear that if you are interested in picking up one of these uh tractors or one of these secret rocks that you're going to need a uh, secret secret right As oh yeah secret. Good point. It says it right here. So it doesn't take nine secret. It says S secret. Important to note, if this is your first time in secret, you think, oh man, I got my, my Luna Terror Adam from, um, you know, one of these other exchange. I went to osmosis and I finally exchange it and I've got my secret now, or maybe Binance, you got secret directly somewhere and you've got secret in your wallet. So you finally got secret in your Kepler wallet. Well, if you go to mint, you're not going to be able to mint anything because it doesn't take regular secret it takes secret secret we actually have this we'll leave a link for all these below but we i've talked about this before the wrap secret bridge every one of these tokens you can wrap and unwrap directly luna adam ust osmo dvpn all of those can be unwrapped directly which is a beautiful thing so for those of you who are in secret swap or sienna and you're providing liquidity on these farms and you're wondering how do i get out of my s digital asset in back into my other digital asset this is a, a great bridge resource for you to get out of multiple wrapped secret assets we can get have secret 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 adam luna stablecoin ust osmo dvpn so uh, quite a selection. And I'm sure as time goes on, the networks grow, there will be more rat digital assets to come in and out of directly. But in the meantime, this is quite, quite a selection. So, oh, yeah. 
Oh, and you this do is is how you would do it. You would you would just your take your yep. It'll show you how much you have secret, how much you have S secret. You just type in the amount, oops, and you click wrap or unwrap, and bada bing, wallet pops up, and it happens like that. It's cool. You just see the change right in front of your eyes. It, it I, I, you know, every time I see these protocols work over the years, you, you know, you sign a contract. You see, mm -hmm. it, it feels it's cool. It's neat because because there's a lot of people when you come and use a website, like there are people that worked hard to create this user interface and to yeah. create the fun. There's a lot of a lot of things happening behind the scenes to for this to work to make this work. So, yeah. um, when so they, it's like it's like when you see a big meal that's been prepared, you think about all the labor that went into the different stages to make that happen. Well, the same understanding applies here too. Absolutely, brother. Um, and secret protocol. We talk about them a lot. The blockchain, they've been around for several years. They've recently linked up with the IBC, which we are very, very bullish on um, what they're bringing oh, yeah. crypto. So I'll just have to, on our way out, leave a little picture of the map, the zones. But yeah, yeah uh, follow. If you want to get involved in, in play to earn gaming and you want to support Secret Network and maybe find some ways to do fun gifts for friends and family, then I I recommend doing your own research to be taking a look at Secret Rocks. It's fun. Yeah. And they haven't even launched. They're going to be coming to Stash app. They haven't come to Stash app yet. They haven't launched their mints. They're still in the early uh, mint, the attractors phase. So they, haven't, they haven't dropped those rocks. You still have time. One still right. has time to get involved early for- And if you've been following with us over the months and weeks, this map of zones is really- developed and there's many more um pro protocols now that you that weren't there earlier when we first started to look at the, looking at this so it's it's awesome to see the development it is this is so cool and uh, as you join us on our journey of crypto DeFi education you will watch this map grow with us it is uh is quite a sight to see and that's leading into the next year i guess if we were to wrap up I, let's leave this video with um, a thought of the end of the year and going into next year. Although we could probably make a video specific for that, but I'll just say, here's a spoiler alert. Things that I learned after 2017, when the market dumps, cause it's going to dump, eventually the market's correct. They need to wash out and, and correct. Don't walk away from crypto. It's a mistake to, to only stay focused when the prices are high and the market's doing well, because a lot like Secret Network was born out of the ICO craze. A lot of great projects during those down times, those are when you see the GitHub's active. Those are when you see different layers being added um, to protocols. Those are the protocols you want to get behind. Because yeah, it's the time to see who's, who's going to remain active. And right. that's the protocols that are, you want to play with and bet on. It's hard to tell who's a winner when the markets are green because everything is going up. There's just right. money flooding in and it just looks like, oh, I'm just a genius investor because I just bought crypto and all look, everything's just, but when it goes red, that's, that's where you can really, I would say that's where the money's made because a lot of money's lost, but that's where some great decisions can be made to set one up. That's where there's a lot of opportunity. Definitely. Honestly. Absolutely. More and better opportunities at better prices than anything you'll see during bull markets. And one thing to ask yourself is if I valued secret or Adam or Luna, if I valued this digital asset at $50 or hundred dollars and the market was great, do I think this is still valuable at $25 and 20? Right. And the answer if is not, maybe you didn't do enough research. Right. Cause, cause what you should be thinking it is, cause it, it really is. <laughs> you'd be like, heck yeah. Heck yeah. yeah. This is a great deal. Yeah. Um, and we do have a video on if you'd like to know ways to protect yourself in downturns. There are some stable plays to do to earn a solid return in stablecoin. Um, some bear uh, strategies. Yeah. Some some bear market strategies. What was the name? Of, do you remember the name of our? Oh, I don't. But it hasn't been that long. It's it's only a few. It's probably about two weeks ago. Yeah, it won't be hard to find. Scroll through our videos if that's something you're interested in learning more about. It was ooh 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 free. Go back. Okay, we do more videos than we thought, but yeah, <laughs> it's in there. There you go. Time to take profit. Macro outlook and stablecoin. That, that's go. a good one right there. Time to take profit. Part two. Yeah, we have part one yep. and part two. Macro outlook and stablecoin. So take a look at that and uh, be be prepared because you know it's going to happen. Markets are going to consolidate. They're going to correct, yep. and people need. It's healthy to take profits. Yeah, take some off the table, and after that's done, you're left with protocols 
that are more vibrant than they were before the run-ups because they've had all this development. And then they're at cheaper prices because you've had all these people mm-hmm. pull off the table. And then you're set up for the next epic. For the next run. The next run. Um, yeah, I think we did a good job covering Secret Rocks. Really wanted to give a shout out to the Secret NFT validator for what they do and what they're doing. And we will be doing more videos covering validators on secret network and right. other and secret networking things. in general too exactly so if you would like to get involved in some old school paper rock and scissors and play to earn i'll we'll battle you we'll battle you i'll, I'll battle you some paper rock scissors we'll yeah this is something you For know sure. we'll do it we'll do it might even uh might even do it live might even do it we'll do a live stream paper rock battle thon we'll go after like the Tor, tor, call out Tor Bear. Tor Bear, paper, rock, scissors, brother. You know, the guy. I need a velvet glove. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. He'll, he'll like, he'll, like, who's calling me out? He'll get all the whole secret foundation rise. He's got like, okay, look, man, I was just joking, brother, but I will right. play on some paper, rock, scissors. Right, right. Uh, so on that note, if you like the video, like, comment, subscribe, you know, any, all the above. And if not, don't. But um, we'll be making more of these and, hopefully sharing uh you know pulling back the curtain on some secrets and yeah so stay tuned until the next time have a beautiful day and namaste y'all so here's a little encore wrap up although we just did a little comprehensive video on secret rocks and secret nfts did want to pull up a tweet that literally just came out as we were um uploading the video so Follow the Secret Rocks, obviously follow their Twitter, and they just posted a tweet, a thread, and a updated trailer of the game that's being released. So again, what's really neat about the Secret Rocks community, not only is it the first play to earn game on the Secret Network, Secret Network's metaverse, with private player versus player battles, they're also giving away an attractor. So to clarify, when we were talking about the secret rocks earlier, because of how many are left unminted, there's going to be a burn at the end. And currently one attractor is worth four rocks, four rock drops. So needing three rocks of any type means you only need to acquire one attractor at the moment to get enough to play the game. So now that may change as more people buy in, you may, uh, it might dilute and, you, and it was made to be if everyone came in and purchased one, uh, one to one. But if there's a burn January 20th and they don't all become minted out, then whoever's holding on to an attractor will earn all those extra 10,100 rocks. I think it's 10,100, we'll find out here. So this thread is very comprehensive. Oh, the promised alpha. See, I was giving you the bay at 34 minutes ago. If I would have posted that video and then this came right out, you would have been missing. You've gotten the beta, not the alpha. So I had to say, let's just add this real quick to get the, the alpha, alphabet, gimel, dot, the whole, the aleph tov, the whole thing, right? Alpha, omega. So here we go. Largest secret rocks airdrops. The secret rocks minting event has been live for 11 days now. And about 7,900 tractors are left to mint. Nobody wants to wait for their rocks forever. We don't want to wait. The community is like, hey, when am I getting my rocks? They listened and they said, we're going to implement a burning feature, attracting the power boost, which means whoever's holding on, whoever did mint one, they're going to get extra rocks to start playing these games. This is very exciting. It's, I, I've in, been involved, experimented, and educated myself in different platforms. And I will say that the, the team, the development team and what's being built here seems very unique and innovative and fun. Let's see. Okay, we already talked about January 20th, 12 p.m. UTC. So that would be 4 a.m. Central Standard. And there are still some attractors left. All unminted attractors will get burnt, giving the rest more attracting power. 10,101 secret rocks will be fairly distributed to the minted attractors. So you have time now. Each tractor costs nine. Now this is a misprint as we went over. It's not nine secret, it's nine S secret. In fact, I'll say, because I can, oops, you mean S secret, right? 
I'm pretty sure they could say no. Look at our website. We changed it. And I'd be wrong. But we were just there. I'm pretty sure it says secrets. Okay. Which uh, makes it 2.25 secret per secret rock NFT. That's right now a great deal. You're able to get a few rocks at a, at a low. For NFTs, play to earn games in blockchain and crypto, not to mention the only privacy smart contract platform that exists by default. Here we go. Um, right now, you'll get 0 0.08, which means there's an 80% chance of getting an additional secret rock airdrop. So what they're saying is that by being an early, by being a hodler of these attractors, there are opportunities for more drops and extra attracting power in the future. They've got a frequently asked questions section and more. So check out their website. We'll leave all these links below. Um, unknown utility trait reveal. Attractors will indeed play a role in the Secret Rocks paper scissors game and will serve as an armor for Secret Rocks. As mentioned in our tweet, announcing the existence of attractors, they are sacred stones in a battle. Uh, which consists of three matches each. A player can equip his or her secret rocks with up to three attractors, which have the ability to shield secret rock per attractor and restart the match if you lose. Therefore, the total amount of matches two players can play is up to nine matches of S secret rock paper scissors. Assuming both players equipped max amount of attractors at different times, attractor shields can be added during the 10 seconds players have to choose their secret rock every match. Do attractors have limits to how many times they can be used as a shield? Yes, they do. Once they hit their limit, users can still utilize the burning staking mechanism. Okay, there, now it's all making more sense. So we mentioned they have a burning mechanism and a staking me mechanism, but before that, they actually have an in-game amount of uses utility. So uh, this is beautiful, very, very dynamic, a lot of different utilities and info like the maximum amount of times the attractor shield can be activated, can be found in the white paper. Learn more about Secret Rocks attractors and their utilities on secretrocks.com pretty sure we've already been here yes okay that is now officially the alpha bet gimel dollar hey bob zion chet tet you had cough alive and bed none sound like i pay so i cut bridge shouldn't talk the aleph top the whole thing right okay we did it now until the next time have a beautiful day namaste y'all